Hey everyone, I just wanted to show you how I discovered the leak in my uh, SeaDoo Rotax uh, 4Tech oil cooler. So I put oil into this jet ski and I was testing the, the level and running the ski and after about five minutes of running I noticed that the oil had this milky color to it. Uh, this is a definite clear indication that you have water mixing with your oil and, and you cannot go any further until you find the problem. So I ran the problem down uh, and found out that it was indeed my oil cooler. It has a hole inside. And I used this this little device here that I made, um, very simple device, very useful for all sorts of things from testing carb pop-off pressures to you know finding leaks in uh, cooling systems and oil systems. Uh, it consists of a, a you know, air pressure regulator, uh, a simple cheap little valve, a T and this this gauge. I got most of the stuff I think at Harbor Freight. Um, it doesn't need to be super high tech, just enough to show you that there's a leak. Anyway, the way this works is uh, you, know, you you close your your regulator almost all the way, and you just crack it just a tiny bit because you see I have 70 pounds of air here, so you you don't want that much air going that quickly into something that you're testing. Um, so you just crack it open and then you make sure this valve is closed. Uh, this is what you use to let the air into the, the system you're testing. So, you know, I stuck in a, a plug on one end and a little adapter I had laying around on another end just hooked up to a hose. And if I open this just a little bit, let some of that air in there. You know, it doesn't take much until before you hear that hiss. I can hear the air escaping somewhere inside there. So, this is very evidently shot. And if you have any, you know, doubt as to where the noise is coming from, you can you can close the holes and and feel hear a little hiss when when you let a finger up. So, I'll definitely be replacing this very soon. Thanks for watching.